Okay, we are back on the water again, and it's a lovely morning. Just a light breeze. The sea's about as flat as it can get because there's no swell whatsoever, not even the slightest. This is a spring tide. Normally, with the movement of the waters, enough, but it just shows how calm it is at the moment. But we're going to head out, and we're um, oh, we're going to make it up as we go. Or we might go fishing. We might do pots. I'm decided yet. I'll decide as I'm going out. I'll just sort of head out of that, and I'll just veer off to whatever I feel is the right place to go. Okay. I use my instinct. Sounds interesting. So we are going to go and pull a couple of pots first, actually, because we're going to take them out deeper with us. So we'll get that done, take them out, drop them, then we'll uh, go from there. We're putting our couple of our little neck pots out as well today, it's just for lobster. The middle bay pots there, sort of flat waters, and um, yeah, we're going to uh, move a couple around. We sort of do it now. few crabs in there that's a decent one that's a decent one but we're gonna let them all go we don't want to keep any today so unless they're exceptionally large we might keep one but I mean that's big but uh, we'll wait yeah we'll wait to get another big one and that one there is quite a dark one I don't like taking those reddier coloured ones because they can be a bit funny the meat can be a bit washy in them See there, it's got that yeah, dark one too. Mm. Right, pressing that bait off with it. Whatever we've got that's freshish. Let's let that one go. We might keep just a couple, but we'll uh, we'll pick out the absolute biggest that we get and return whatever else. 
again, this one can be a little bit fresh because this is going out to Spider Land eventually. Get that part of it. Perfect weather to do this one. Well, it's so calm, it's terrible for the new spot when it's rock. Banging around it to make the boat dig in and get wet and this one. Him. There he is, that side of the pot, just a small one. That pot's got a few crab in it. Wow, look in the back of that one. Oh, oh, oh. That's a bruise of that one. <laughs> Definitely. Hold on to that one for now. That is in the biggie range, that one. This one's got a hell of a big shell because I'm struggling to get it out of the neck. There we go. Look at that thing. Another belter. <laughs> how fast the tides run out here on the spring tides this isn't the biggest of spring tides either we are moving at pace That one? Yeah. It's a big, it's a 
big insulation cable that we got on today. <laughs> what? Not lower then. No, no, it's the big insulation. You know. Lures, we don't bother with lures. Where we fish, we don't need lures. No. Little golden coloured ras. Look at that. She's got I'm herself so a goldfish. Oh, well, there it is. Lovely coalfish that Rebecca's just had. Yeah, we don't get many of these. Some people will think, oh, that's uh, common, but it's not here. So I've caught. We had. A, I had. Well, we have two last year, I think. Yeah. And oh, apart from that, open. probably in the last ten years, I've probably caught four or five. And that's it. So that shows you they are rare here. But lovely goldfish, lovely. I'm chuffed to bits, I am. Yeah, I bet. Yeah. It took a gamble to move Mark, and at the moment it's paying off. Just had some mackerel, a couple of big pollock. Now we've got something else on here. Yeah, I had a whole washing line full. Get in there, look at these. Absolute clonkers. Oh, oh, big pollock coming. Oh, it's ripping line. Screaming <laughs> <laughs> line off. Didn't get into the bottom, that's the only thing. You've got a 50 pound line on there, remember that. But... Right. I'm going to attempt to put my rod down and get in on the action. I want to see this one come up. It's a nice fish. Yeah. Another good one. Yeah, look at that. Oh, they're so heavy. Just hold her up so we can get a shot of it. Yeah, that's a. That's a lovely fish. Turn it around. There you go. Look at that. Absolute belter. Got in. Got to turn the boat on. Oh, no. Pull it out. Big fish. I can't believe that. That was pulling down on it. Something. Must have been a sign of rock in there. Why did you go to the other one? Oh, it's out. The rock went to the ship. Yeah, I lost it. Damn it. That was annoying. See it? You went and yanking it down. Yeah. Off, that's why. Oh. oh well. You win some, you lose some. On that one, we lost some. At least you didn't lose all the gear as well. Nah, got that out. Hulk obviously just pulled out the fish. He must have been just under the weed a bit. Well, it's um, not any dirt, it's actually eaten away. 
Yeah. Look at that. What's left of a lobster? Might have been killed by the spider crab, it can happen. Would have been under anyway, that one. But... There's a spider that's in here. Look at this thing. Another giant today. Skull crusher. And these are big pots. When you see that, that's just mental. <laughs> Another beast, that one. We'll have a look at them later. Oh, lobster in your pot. A nice pot, that. Seems like the monsters, I told you the monsters are out here, but they're on this side at the moment. Yeah. Right, I'm gonna put you down, because it's complicated otherwise. He's only got one claw, has he lost the claw as well? Get him out so you can get those crabs get old enough to game over for the other claw. See that? How big it is? But it's bigger. We don't need to take them that small. Well, small. <laughs> we need to take them that big, I should say. No, we, it, there's more than enough around at the moment. This is huge, this crab here as well. Look. well. I'll show you the lobster quickly. It's missing a claw, but it's a big one. But this, look at the size of this crab. But we're gonna let him go, this one. Off he goes. It'll be a six pounder next year, for sure. Like I say, we're getting so many big ones now. This just, I'm just not gonna take, all, take them all, with so many of them this year. It's, it's brilliant, I mean, it's fantastic. This. catching more than enough of them so don't get greedy save something for tomorrow or next week or next year right got a little bit of bait for you so i just pulled this uh, crab out of a pot look at the claw it's got such a weird claw deformed claw see that there but that is one weird looking claw anyway yeah it's in one piece it hasn't been damaged it's just I think it's just a misgrowth anyway we're gonna let him go <laughs> turn it around He's got a slightly funny claw as well. That is just monstrous. Yeah. Oh well, put him in our monster box, that one. We'll, uh, we'll have to sort them out when we get back in, what we're gonna keep, what we're gonna let go. We've got some, you see, stored, but we're gonna let those go, I think, and replace them with these big ones. They're big. 